The election is held in two rounds, with the second next Sunday. Victory for Macron's party would be a watershed moment, pushing the two established parties to the sidelines. The latest polls are showing that his republic on the move, LREM party, has an insurmountable lead over their rivals. The latest polls from Ipsos France on Friday shows LREM claiming 397 to 427 seats in the National Assembly, far more than the needed majority of 289 seats. However, if Macron's party secures an absolute majority in the Assembly, analysts say the Premier still has to push through a string of labour and education reforms, as well as other difficult issues. Meanwhile, the Republicans are only expected to obtain 95 to 115 seats and the Socialist Party 22 to 32 seats. Both the centre-right Republicans and the Socialists failed to reach the presidential runoff last month for the first time in France's post-war history. Marine Le Pen's party, meanwhile, looks set to struggle to win 15 seats nationally, a score that would represent another deep disappointment after she was soundly beaten by Macron. But Le Pen remains defiant, claiming that we will be the only opposition force. Few MPs are expected to be elected in this first round of voting. Only candidates who win more than 50% of the vote will do so. Otherwise, all candidates who secure at least 12.5% will go into the second round, where the winner takes the seat.